TLO, what's poppin'? We are on Twitch. We are not live. But you can leave a like, comment, subscribe. Turn on your post notification bells. Let's continue to grow the family from Chicago to the UK. Right behind me, you see it. It's Premier League times. And it's week seven or week six. It's one of those weeks. You see it down on the title, man. Uh, this is Chelsea versus Brighton. It's up first on my little docket. I honestly came into this not really thinking nothing, but then Palmer got a hat trick in the first 30 minutes of the game. Now, let's be real. I have, I've watched a few Chelsea highlights on over on Patreon. Link down in the description if you want to watch along and react with me. Honestly, this is the funniest thing I've done <laughs> in a minute. So, anywho, Palmer, hat trick, first 30 minutes of play. Has not started a game this season, I don't believe, until today. He proved himself in practice once again. He came out on the field and doubled down on it. But he scored four goals. What we call four goals? Hat trick plus one? That's tough. That's tough. There was almost a couple other people invited to the party, but there were a lot of offsides being called. Chelsea was being aggressive at that net. But Palmer... Star of the show, man. We 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 saw the assist to Palmer, but actually Palmer scored back to back. I wanted to ask y'all, why did he get two penalty shots? I don't. I I missed it. You know, I'm still new, so he scored on both of them joints. The second one from distance, the spin he put on that ball to get up there, tough. His fourth goal, tough. Threaded the needle. These weren't easy shots he were taking. Buddy was putting that ball in that net. I ain't even going to hold you. This is a pretty impressive game. Like, this is, I think four is the most I've ever seen a team score. Maybe. I don't know. And Chelsea got the best jerseys in the league. So. All right, game two on my little docket. You know what I'm saying? Manchester United versus Hotspurs. Not going to lie to you. Um, me, personally, I got no faith in Man U. They haven't really showed me anything this season. I mean, I wasn't. The only thing I expect, only team I expect anything from is uh, Man City and Liverpool. Liverpool is my team. Man City, you got the best player on the league. So, of course, I expect a lot from you. So, at, at the end of the day. But I, I, I thought the Hotspurs were going to win. They won 3-0. It, 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 at some points during the game, it didn't even seem like Manchester United wanted to play, man. It's it's that it's getting deep out here, and my whole sentiment is, don't get relegated. Don't you get pushed back? It'll only be Manchester City out there, Man City out there holding it down. You know what I'm saying? Three zero is tough, and it was a boring game. I was getting, I didn't watch the whole game. I only watched highlights over on. Uh, over on Patreon, but I just got the vibe that this was a boring game. I got boring vibes, and like halfway through the, the game, the fans were leaving. So, like, the stands weren't even full. The, the, the regular fans didn't have faith in it. So it was tough to watch, man. Shout out to the Hotspurs, though. They won two sucky teams. Somebody got to win, <laughs> right? <laughs> <laughs> Woo! Not gonna lie. Newcastle United versus Manchester City. I came into that game thinking Manchester City was gonna beat them badly. I'm talking about 6 0. But obviously, I didn't know Newcastle's body of work. I am a casual. I'm just now learning. This is only my sixth week. Don't forget, we do got full-length highlights on Patreon. Reactions. Um, link down in the description. Now, as we all know, I am a Liverpool supporter through and through. I think they can win it all this year. Now, I, at this point in the video, I have not seen the highlights for the Liverpool game yet. I do not know who won. So hopefully I do not eat my words, but this is a great result for somebody that can try to move into first place. You know what I'm saying? 
This is a great result. I know we still got a long season. But Manchester United, Newcastle, they're almost like mirror images of, of, of Manchester City, which was crazy to watch, crazily boring to watch. You know what I'm saying? But at the end of the day, they had Holland on an island behind bars. And it's crazy because that's exactly what Newcastle's uniforms look like, jail uniforms. But they had them in a, a bro. They had bro in a box. I never seen him absolutely do nothing. Is his teammates mad at him? Like they wouldn't even trying to get him the ball. Whoever the manager of is Newcastle, that was great strategy. I'm not going to take anything away from you by saying Holland had an off game and Man City just wasn't clicking. Because y'all just play good defense at the end of the day. Shout out Newcastle. I don't know your body of work, but you're helping my team achieve first place. Hopefully, we're in first place. I'm going to check. As soon as I do the Liverpool highlights, I'm saving it for last. Arsenal's up next. It is what it is. You know what I'm saying? I'm not going to lie. As I was doing the reaction to the extended highlights over on Patreon, link down in the description. I, I honestly, I had, if I'm being real, I had Arsenal winning. And be real, Leicester is, they just got moved up to the Premier League. They're, they haven't won a game. Arsenal went up 2-0. Leicester Sear tied it up. I was excited. I was excited to come on here and talk a lot of SHIT. I was excited. I was overly excited because uh, Man City got a draw today. And if Arsenal would have got a draw or lost to this team, after so many people was in the comments telling me it was a two-man race and Liverpool this, Liverpool that, oh, yeah, y'all would have had a lot to deal with. But, you know, I'm not talking in hypotheticals. Congratulations on your win today. It was 2-2 in the 95th minute in, in the extra time. They put Saka in that corner, and, I, ah, man, he's – I. I've only been watching for six weeks, but I know what he do from there. He going to put it on the money almost 100% of the time for it to be a score. Like 90, 80%. Saka in that corner. Going to put it in, going to put a teammate in position to score. And that's what happened. And then they scored again. And with, they scored twice in the extra minutes. That's just serious. You suck. You suck. You have one job. I'm not going to lie. I was nervous. We had San, uh, Sanchez was out because he was sick. I, I, he better be sick. He better have had a 103 degree fever. He better have had something dire. Because to put me through that much stress is insane. And then we had a, 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 a Allison, the goalie, our goalie, our main goalie wasn't there. And you could tell when the Wolves scored that second part, that first point, we won. Let's, let's, let's clear that up first and foremost. We've, had, we've safely secured first place in the Premier League. <laughs> yeah. Okay, but nevertheless, I was still stressed. You know what I'm saying? Kanata, salute to you, brother. You got a 45-inch vertical. You scored our first goal. Salute. But I don't know what you were thinking when the Wolves scored their first goal. You and Allison's communication, hey, this might be y'all last time on a pitch. I don't want to see it again. I don't want to see it again. My heart was beating. I got high blood pressure. You almost sent me. Now, this is a great opportunity to see Man City in second place, and we secured it. 
Now, if you'd like to hate on us in the comments, fine. But if your team in this standing does not have a one next to it, just know your argument is not valid. Maybe you can argue with me next week. Probably not. <laughs>